Volvo has for several years made a wide-ranging and thorough analysis of a variety of different scenarios for cars with electric power. Being one important and natural part of the company's Toward Zero strategy, a holistic plan to reduce CO2 emissions. The chosen custom-made 24 kilowatt-hour battery system for the Volvo C30 electric is based on state-of-the-art lithium-ion batteries of which 22.7 kilowatt-hours is used to power the car. The high-capacity rechargeable batteries are made of hard carbon and mixed oxide, in which the lithium ions move from the negative electrode to the positive electrode during discharge and back again when charging. One advantage is that the battery can be charged around 3,000 times. That corresponds to 8 to 10 years of daily usage, with 70 to 80 percent of the battery's capacity left. Another advantage is that up to 80 percent of the kinetic energy can be absorbed back into the battery through brake generation. A benefit that means that the driving range can be prolonged with 10 to 15 kilometers during normal driving. The battery will be fully charged in less than 8 hours when using a normal socket of 230 volts and a 16 amp outlet. It's a great opportunity for us at NRDL to be involved in this uh, significant automotive milestone. Our close working relationship with Volvo in this advanced project is providing invaluable knowledge and experience in developing better, safer and more efficient batteries for the automotive industry in all aspects and promises lower costs for everyone involved. The optimal temperature range is from plus 10 to 30 degrees centigrade. This means that the battery's own climate system must function not only when driving, but also when charging, in order to prevent excessively warm or cold battery temperatures, regardless of the outside temperature. Volvo has made hundreds of virtual tests, as well as tests on the component level, to see how the 280 kilogram heavy battery is affected by harsh braking and the subsequent collision. They have also carried out advanced full-scale crash tests to evaluate the technology used in electrically powered cars. A battery-powered Volvo must be as safe as any other Volvo car. To help protect the occupants, the encapsulated batteries are positioned in the middle of the car outside the crumpled zones. Safety will never be a compromise for Volvo cars. The location of the batteries has, as a bonus, given the car an ideal weight distribution. 56% in the front and 44% in the rear, contributing to excellent road manners.